Porto Caras Grand Resort is a legendary place. At 1963, a cruise to Mount Athos begins for the celebration of the 1,000 years since the creation of the monastic community of Athos. Among them, the ship owner Yanis Karas. They cruise offshore Scythania, enter the Tornaeus Gulf, and the fairy tale begins. Yanis Karas falls in love with the virgin site. On the rocky and infertile Galani Hill, the famous Villa Halini was built by the renowned Greek architect Kamsambelis. Extending on the surface of 2,000 square meters, a sample of unique architecture and beauty furnished with exceptional monastic furniture and unique artworks. The magazines in the 70s featured it as one of the most beautiful buildings in the country. The first vineyards and olive groves began to be planted at the beginning of 1965, while work also commenced then on the innovative tourism resort which is associated with the domain Porto Caras, creating a real revolution in the hotel and winemaking sector in Greece at that time. On the western side of Hal Kidiki's Sithonia Peninsula, where the verdant slopes of Mount Meliton stretch down to mingle with the crystal clear waters of Torneo Bay, 475 hectares of the largest organic Greek vineyards lie in amphitheater-like formation. These vineyards are some of the largest in Europe. The domain's people have respected the magnificence of this unique environment. Wherever there were forests, they have been left untouched. Thus the trees today still constitute a natural barrier, trapping the evening atmospheric moisture which helps the vines withstand the hot days of summer. In 2000, Porto Caras Grand Resort was acquired by Technical Olympic Group of Companies. Today, the slopes of Mount Meliton vineyards are a model of organic viniculture, in line with modern international trends, respecting the consumer and the environment. Thanks to the exceptional climate conditions prevailing in the area, the Domain's vineyards are today considered to be one of the rarest cases where most vine diseases are confronted using organic processes. Plant protection is achieved solely by using sulfur and copper, so that cultivation is certified as purely organic, since organic fertilizers are used. The yield per 1,000 square meters, which does not exceed 800 kilos, demonstrates that the viticultural potential of the area is extremely high. The hilly areas in the region create excellent ecological conditions for cultivating the 24 select varieties that thrive on the southwestern slopes at an altitude of 200 to 300 meters. These conditions allow the Assyrtiko, Athiri, Malaguzia, Sauvignon Blanc, and Roditi's varieties to produce the highest quality white wines. Malaguzia, a variety almost extinct, was revived at Domaine Porto Caras. After experimental plantings, the possibility of the variety were recognized and the production of high quality and balanced wines with high aromatic potential began. Among the red wines, the famed Greek Limnion variety, referred to in texts of Aristotle, stands out accompanied by the cosmopolitan varieties Cabernet Sauvignon, Cabernet Franc, Sauvignon Blanc, Merlot, and Syrah. 
which at altitudes from 300 to 400 meters have adapted wonderfully to the cool northeastern slopes of the region. The winery was built in 1970 and along with the vineyards was a milestone in the Greek wine industry. Its location in the valley was chosen to be invisible to the passer, both from the road and the sea, thereby protecting the beauty of the landscape. It is also worth mentioning the extremely significant contribution of the father of modern winemaking, University of Bordeaux professor Emile Peinot, who assisted in developing the first Greek Cabernet Sauvignon, Chateau Porto Caris, ideally adapted to the chalky and schistose soils of the domain, allows this variety to achieve great heights internationally, winning coveted awards, prizes and medals. The design and selection of the winery location at the center of the vineyard helps in fast delivery and process of grapes, aiming at maintaining their quality dynamics and to avoid oxidation. The wines are vinified with skill and care within the winery's state-of-the-art facilities by experienced oenologists who are students of the great Emile Peinot. Since 2000, the Technical Olympic Group of Companies has assisted dynamically in modernizing the winery. The production process is achieved with the most modern equipment. Pneumatic press, special tanks for pre-fermentation extraction. Stainless steel tanks for fermentation with double wall. Automatic control fermentation temperature. At the same time in the winery's air-conditioned cellar, authentic French oak barrels, which are being replaced each year, ensure ideal aging conditions for the leading red wines, and in particular, Chateau Porto Caras and Syrah Porto Caras. Domain Porto Caras is awarded every year in domestic and international wine competitions, with many subheadings underlining the superior quality of its wines. Thank you.